I know, I know what you're thinking. Forgive the man. Nobody's perfect, but I do forgive him. I always did. Why would a world-famous poet, a literary celebrity, stoop to help a man of such negligible redeeming value and at such a cost to his own reputation and livelihood? Simon Grimm fans the world over have seized upon this mysterious friend, Henry Fool, and his fabled confessions as an essential key to the deeper understanding of the incarcerated garbage man poet of Woodside, Queens. Agent Fulbright, CIA. I guess, has it ever occurred to you that perhaps Henry's confessions were simply too completely awful to be true? The French Secret Service have two books of Henry's confession. They were found in the possession of a notorious drug smuggler who swears that he got them from Bibi Konchalovsky. And who is that? A terrorist, wanted by the Russians, the Israelis, the French, and us. Fulbright, Henry was a garbage man. So what the hell was he doing in Afghanistan in 1989, for instance? Did your father ever tell you unusual bedtime stories when I wasn't around? Sure, all the time. Simon, you gotta get out of jail. I can't handle all this on my own. The Germans, the Belgians, the Israelis, China. Nobody wants the French to hand over these books to the US. Believe me, Faith, this is critical. And you're the only one who can do what needs to be done. You should not have done this. I had to get you out of prison, Simon, and see it worked. We are in love with the same man. Hey, I do not love that man, okay? Faye, Henry's alive. How goes the jihad, you cheap fuck? I mean, if I were a world-famous terrorist. I'm not a world-famous terrorist. Yeah, and whose fault is that? She's here. Shit. You gotta go home? No, wait, hold on. How the hell did she find me? She seems to love you very much. I knew you would be good. Hey, listen, take it easy. You 